Well, welcome, friends, to the RLS Vlog. It is time for the December 2020 update, and it's going to be a short one because I have not had RLS since the end of October. In fact, October 29th was the last time I had RLS. Now, there may have been a time or two in the last month that I might have had it, but didn't really recognize it. I did an awful lot of drinking in November, just like I did in October and September and August and all the way back to April when the pandemic lockdown first started. I'm uh, several days sober now and I'm going to remain sober from here on out because I'm really close to the surgery date. Uh, tomorrow, which is the 4th of December, I got to go in and have a COVID test, get tested for COVID-19. And if that does not come back positive, then the surgery is going to be happening on Tuesday, December 8th. And it's just going to be a simple hernia surgery, as far as I know, a robotic surgery. I had a meeting a couple of days ago with the surgeon's office, and we went over all the stuff and the prep and all the rest. So it uh, uh, looks like it's going to actually happen despite the freeze the pandemic freeze lockdown that we're now in uh, pardon me it ended it ended yesterday the freeze was a two-week period of lockdown and it ended but the restrictions have not so now we're still have the same restrictions which means my workplace is still only doing takeout and um I'm still actually scheduled to work. I'm scheduled to work Saturday, and the last time I worked was last Monday. So I'm usually working about 10 hours a week, and that's it. So I am collecting unemployment, so um, so far, so good. Everything's working out. Hopefully, this see, these restrictions won't be around for too much longer, but I would expect till the end of the year. So uh, that's bad news for the business and so many other businesses out there that are just suffering terribly. But uh, anyway, we're, I'm doing pretty good. Uh, pretty nervous about this surgery coming up. Uh, it sounds like it's going to be a, a real snap. Um, my, I go in at 6.30 in the morning. I get a ride there and a ride back because can't drive. And... Uh, you know, at that time, and uh, sounds like it's going to take about two hours for the surgery, and then, of course, I have to, you know, wake up and recovery time there, but apparently, if nothing goes wrong, they're going to send me home the same day, so I would expect I would be back here by probably 12 noon or something, so that would be good news. Uh, hope everything's going to go good. I'm Looking forward to it. I should be off. Uh, I should be unable to work for two weeks, for the first two weeks. And I'll be limited to lifting only 15 pounds during that time. And if everything looks good, I'll go back on the 21st for a follow-up appointment. And if everything seems good, then uh, maybe I can go back to work on a uh, limited scale uh, again, probably no more than 15 pounds for the first month. So anyway, it's working out pretty good. I am collecting more and more hospital bills, unfortunately. That's not looking good. But I am uh, getting unemployment and all that good stuff. And the RLS is has basically ceased. It's quite cold here now. We have a lot of days where we get up to a high temperature of like 38 or 39 degrees, and that's it. And then it drops back down into the very low 30s overnight, and we have a lot of fog and stuff like that. So that can be pretty miserable. But anyway, we're uh, doing pretty good, and hopefully the RLS will leave me alone for the rest of this year and into January and February. But I'll have regular updates on... Um, what's going on uh, hernia-wise and uh, 
maybe if, if after this hernia repair I'll feel better and if I got more time off of work which looks quite likely for a while uh, maybe I can get out and do some things and get out and get some exercise and some hiking and take the camera out and about and uh, just get out there and try to have some fun so that's my November 2020 RLS update. Hope everybody out there is doing well, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.